हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट वी आर इन प्रैक्टिकल नंबर नाइन ड्रग इंफॉर्मेशन स्टोरेज एंड रिट्रीवल यूजिंग एम एस एक्सेस सो दिस प्रैक्टिकल इज ऑल्सो रिलेटेड विद प्रैक्टिकल नंबर फाइव दैट इज पेशेंट इंफॉर्मेशन डाटा बेस यूजिंग एम एस एक्सेस सो आई हैव गिवन द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स ऑफ दिस प्रैक्टिकल और यू कैन सी द प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ कंप्यूटर एप्लीकेशन इन फार्मेसी ऑन माई यूट्यूब चैनल like the video and subscribe the channel for more updates before we see uh, how to do that uh, demo in ms access firstly you should understand what is the benefit of using query uh, so this query it is utilized uh, in this ms access so that we can have a limited data on the basis of a limited data we can work so the first thing about using this query is view the data only from the fields you are interested in viewing suppose you want to see that how much patients are male and female if you want to count it you can count uh, that male and female or if you want to suppose say uh, according to date of birth you want to you want the patient just you want uh, what are the date of birth of this patient so just you can interested field what you require you can uh, just check that field so there is no need to go through whole table just uh, for interested field what you require you can go through this query and when you open a table you see all the fields the query is a handy way to save the selection of an fields like suppose uh, from a locality i want some local patients from delhi i want some patients from mumbai so i will just choose uh, patients from delhi or patients from in mumbai or i will just click on the uh, what is their address and just have that address from which location or which geography people are from by using this query we can analyze uh, very simply by using only an interested field combine the data from several data sources a table usually only displays the data that it stores query let us pick the choose field from various sources specify how information can be combined so it is like an hyperlink you might have learned in excel uh, so that can be done using a query but in this practical i have not shown this second point how to do it uh, i have gone only through the experiment in which simple manner you can understand use expressions as a field for example you could use the data function as a field or you could use a format function with a field to control the way the data from the field is formatted in the query results and last point is that view the records that meet the criteria that you specify so in the earlier case also you have uh, i have told that if you want only a uh, male patient data according to date of birth so that can be arranged uh, so by this way we can arrange anything or suppose say we want to know the hemoglobin of an patients so your uh, one of an tab in patient information should be of an hemoglobin uh, and uh, according to the hemoglobin if we want in ascending manner or we want in descending manner or if we want in uh, average so we can uh, identify what is the uh, hemoglobin of this uh, particular group so query is handy way to save the selection of an records so there is no need to go uh, again and again or to the records and see all the data only your interested field you can see by using this query now we are in ms access so already you know this ms access because in the fifth practical we have learned about this ms access and how to create the patient information database in ms access we have learned about it uh, so here you can see the table that is patient information table just click right on it and open the table now this was the these are some six entries uh, five entries sorry there are five entries that i have made of an patient so in this uh, practical what we have to do we have to select some specific data and according to that specific data uh, whether we have to make it in ascending order or descending order or we have to sort in any way so only that particular fields we will require suppose say uh, we want like which are the consulting doctors just we want this field we don't want the name of patient or we don't want the id number or there is no need of an address 
uh, or we want just only which are the male patients or which are the female patients or we want the date of birth according to date of birth we have to arrange the data so these are some examples what kind of data we want we don't want whole uh, thing for you know further purpose just we want some selected columns for further purpose so for this purpose uh, now patient information already we have done this practical uh, in the fifth practical uh, so this database it is now ready uh, if you are not having this database make it uh, make this database i have given a link in the description box of fifth practical uh, so you can refer also a playlist of in fifth practical and you can make this database according to the fifth practical now what we have to do we have to uh, come in the menu tab main menu so there you can see create and in that create uh, here we are having query wizard so which helps you to create a simple query uh, and find a duplicate query or find unmatched query so just click on it so once you click on it so this window will appear so there is no uh, we are going for an only a simple query wizard uh, we will not go for this duplicate query wizard or unmatched query wizard or cross tab query wizard. So just we are going for simple query wizard. We want them uh, just simple tables. So which fields you want. So here the message it comes which field do you want uh, in your query. Uh, you can choose more than one table or a query. So suppose say uh, I just want a consulting doctor uh, and according to that I so for consulting doctor select the field and click on this tab after that uh, I want the patient first name so I will click on the patient first name after that last name and middle name of the patient uh, so as you want it now click on the next see here modify the query design and open the query uh, to view information so click on if you need to modify it you can also modify it just I will show now you can see uh, only consulting doctors uh, so we I have selected that firstly consulting doctor and after that these are the name of patient the, uh, Ganesh Rao Vijay so by this way a limited data the for the patient information query or query wizard it works for a limited data we does not require whole data of a patient we will have just a simple data we uh, don't want a whole data like what is his address or what is his zip code uh, so just whatever the specific data we want we can uh, do by with the help of this practical so this is how you can finish the practical if you are having any query related with this practical you can comment me in the comment box section i will definitely answer it